Imagine a life that consists of backbreaking work every single day. And even at the end of that day, you couldn't provide more than one meal for your children. Imagine having a little girl whose only opportunity for education was if you entrust her into the hands of a complete stranger. Imagine having to walk great distances for water. Or imagine having a hunger in your soul to know about God and having no one available to teach you or to point you in the direction to learn about Him. That's the reality of life in villages like here in Maboom Station, Sierra Leone. They don't have the same opportunities that we have. And because of that, life year after year, generation after generation goes on unchanged. This is where we, the Wesleyan Church of Iowa, Minnesota District, in cooperation with World Hope International and the Wesleyan Church International, have been given the opportunity to come in and to make changes, not only for today, but for generations to come. The 36 churches of the Iowa, Minnesota District are being challenged one by one to make a difference in Maboon Station for the long run, for eternity. In partnership with World Hope International and the Village Partnership Program, we are endeavoring over a period of three years to establish a pineapple farm, put in a fresh water well, and then to establish a church where none currently exists. Year one will provide agricultural training for the members of Maboom Station. In addition to this, this will equip them to provide food through a 10-acre pineapple farm, which not only will feed them, but will provide them a source of revenue, of ongoing income, of allowing them to educate their children, dramatically reducing the likelihood that they're going to have to entrust that child or children into the hands of a stranger. We are discovering with increasing regularity here that rather than educating the children, those children are being taken into either the sex traffic or the labor traffic in Sierra Leone. In year two, our partnership with World Hope will place a freshwater well drilled right in Maboom Station. The people will not have to walk miles to get their fresh water. Time saved by not walking the great distance then becomes available to them for education and they can focus on the things that matter even more in their life. And the deep well virtually guarantees that this water is pure and clean year round and does not dry up when the dry season comes. This guarantees a much higher quality of life and longevity of the life of each individual. Nearly from day one, the Wesleyan Church will be sharing the gospel with the people of Maboom through the Jesus Film Project. This allows them to disciple the people, establish a vibrant group of new believers, and work towards establishing a permanent church in the area. At some point then in the three-year project, we will actually provide the funds which will buy the materials as they get the national labor force together and actually construct a physical church building in Maboom Station. Because our role as the Wesleyan Church of Iowa, Minnesota is not to do the work, but to enable the work, we probably won't be sending teams over as you might think with the traditional mission field project. Providing this opportunity to the nationals, those who call Maboom Station home, creates a deep sense of ownership and loyalty to the project. The project is broken down into three segments, each costing approximately $25,000. Now that sounds like a lot of money, and we know that not every church is able to contribute at the same level. But let me do some simple math for you here. If you take the $25,000 per year and divide it by the 36 churches in our district, it amounts to only $700 per year per church. This is the challenge before us. We've met with these people, we've talked with them, we've seen the need. So we share that need with you today. The question is, what are you going to do about it?